Your next car is probably here at the Geneva Motor Show, but if you bear off the beaten track, there are all sorts of things to surprise you at every corner. Come and join us on a whistle-stop tour of a weird and wonderful machine at the Geneva Motor Show 2013. The new Rinspeed Micromax imagines how we might travel around cities in the future. You'll be standing upright, there are no seats here, and there's even a coffee machine on board. It's one of the tallest cars at the show. If you prefer to sit down while you're in your car, come and join us in this Bentley Mulzan executive specification. We've got iPads built into the back of the seats. We've got these rather wonderful duck down filled leather cushions as well to get comfy. It's a real sign that people want to carry on working, being connected, socialising while they're in their cars. You might be stuck in a traffic jam, but you still want to be productive. If you can't afford the quarter of a million pound Bentley Mulzan SE, MTM has something for you. It's a mobile boardroom with a 32-inch flat-screen TV. Now you can watch big-screen movies on the move. One thing's for certain at Geneva, if you have enough money, you can personalise anything on your car. From Pagani, we have the world's fastest luggage set. Mansori will make you a carbon fibre golf buggy, and Mazda will even chop an MX-5 in half to make the ultimate games console. We're not sure about some of the paint jobs on offer, though, Many of these colours are less neutral than our Swiss hosts. Now, if we told you that your next car was going to be powered by compressed air, I suspect you would accuse us of talking a load of hot air. But it's going to happen. Peugeot and Citroën are developing something called hybrid air. It uses compressed air and hydraulic pressure, like in a diver's oxygen tank, to power the car at low speeds. It's a pretty clever bit of kit, and it's not pie in the sky either. This is going to go on sale in 2016. Many of the concept cars of the Geneva Motor Show remain pleasingly left field. There's a selection of amphibious cars. KTM is trying to kid us you can commute in a crossbow, now it's fitted a proper windscreen and doors, and the wonderfully named Ital Design Giugiaro Parkour is an off-roader that's powered by a Lamborghini engine. There are a few crazier car shows than Geneva. The Toyota iRoad will go 30 miles on one electric charge. It's a form of novel city car being developed by Toyota and it could solve all our urban parking problems. At just 85 centimetres wide, you can fit four of these in one single parking space. There are some fabulously weird and wonderful sights at the 2013 Geneva Motor Show, but can you tell which are fact and which are fiction?